that's fine. On your table is some stuff that you're going to work with. So that's the materials for the workshop. Okay. So I'm going to start with some questions. Who here is doing TDD in your teams? Okay. If you're not coding yourself, if you're a scrum master, if your teams are. What is the point of defining a test before you start? Sorry? Fail early. Fail early? Say that again? Do just what is required. You do what is required. What is just, required. just what is required. Anything else? You will know when you are done. You'll know when you're done? Yes. And you know where you're going to, right? You've defined up front where you're going. So, what is continuous improvement? Inspect and adapt. Yes. We don't often think about these two things together. So, in this workshop, oh wait, before I go there, how do we do our inspect and adapt? What is the process we use? Or you guys? You use retrospectives. Anybody doing anything else? Okay, yeah? Problem solving. Problem solving. So typically in Agile, we use retrospectives. From Lean, there's A3 Thinking and Kaizen, which is where the title of this workshop comes from. And they all come from something called the scientific method. And what is that? There are many explanations, and I'm going to do it as visually as I can. We start off by looking clearly at what our environment is. And then we question and analyze. We, we look deeply into it. First we look at and then we look in. From that, we formulate an idea about how the system can be changed, what would be valuable. And then we implement our experiment. And that would be in the course of our sprint or however we determine our, uh, the plan. Then we stop and we check our results. That's typically where our um, retrospectives come in, right? And then we assess the implications of the change in the system. Or do we? So the point of this talk is uh, that uh, I'm not getting the thing. This area over here. From month to um, month, or sprint to sprint, however long your sprints are, week to week, we make a change and we see at the end of the sprint whether we have succeeded and what, and uh, we measure our success and then we.